And welcome. I'm Spike. Uh, pretty apparent, but you know, maybe you didn't look and you just clicked for whatever reason. I don't know why you would. I don't even know how you would know about me, actually, unless you actually, like, have been watching my videos for a minute. Anyways, uh, yeah, wait, hold on. First you go. Okay. I'm at Tundra. This is good. Russia is very nice for Tundra, so... I might move over one because I'm gonna have to use that forest pretty hard for that food. Because I can't build farms. And that volcano will also give me food. Yeah, I'll move. I'll mount smoke a little. Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, don't they? I mean... I'm sure they do, right? <laughs> Alright, uh... Oh, we got a three production one. I might go with... No, nah, I'm gonna go with the three food. Till we grow one. Alright, uh... Yeah, it's working the three production right now. That's why shit's going so fast. So now it's gonna be five turns, yeah. An extra two turns, but I don't mind it because... I start off with two food and two production because uh, in Tantra Tiles it gives you an extra one production and when you found a city it gives you one extra food than what's on the tile. So my capital's got one, uh, two and two, so it's actually a pretty good capital. Pretty decent starting out anyways. Who the fuck's this? Really? Dude, you was that close to greenness, come on. Chill. As a matter of fact, hold on. Go back up there, you son of a bitch. Ow. Ow. I just ganked the cord. I don't know how that didn't fuck up, but no, okay. <laughs> Problem. Ow, dude. I don't know how the fuck I just ganked on that cord and it didn't, like, stop the mic from working. As soon as it's still being ordered, though. Oh, I got Levanta next to me. I'll probably take Levanta over. They're kind of half in the dungeon as well, so not bad. Before I saw smoke for a second. Oh, well. Alright, that's about the way I wanted you to go. Oh, yes. And another uh, scout, and then a builder, most likely. I wonder if it's work in production now. Yeah. Uh, we'll work uh, two food and two production. For now. Yeah, because I'd just like to grow a bit more. Just the three tiles and I'll work two production. Like two good production tiles and I'll be good. Uh, what do I have? I got mining already, didn't I? I'm pretty sure I did. So, mining... Let's see. Ooh, I do have farmland that I'm extending to. So maybe I'm good on the food area. We'll get, um... I many I do have animals near my capital. Few. But is it worth that? I think I'm gonna rush that first, and then I'll do that. Because I'd like to uh, get the hanging gardens first for uh, growth. One new motherfucker. My ass. Uh, there isn't that many uh, two food, two uh, production tiles anymore. There's that, but it's not much. That'll have to work. As long as the scout's still getting done in that amount of time, I'm fine. Honestly, it doesn't bother me. I can settle a city kind of in the mountains there. And I should be good uh, wherever I settle it for a good one or two. Oh my god, dude, I can take so many cities here. My conquest shall begin. I'm planning 10,000 things a second and they're all wrong. <laughs> yeah, I'll do that. And two builders. Because... I'll take six turns, and I'm about to grow in four turns, so by the time it grows, I can just use that, and I'll still have B3 population. 
Mexico City. Is that production? It is not. I think it might be. Oh damn! Fucking political philosophy is already like like that. What plus one production? Oh yeah. Well, that's down to the wire. <laughs> that's really down to the wire, huh? Oh well. And I also got some hills in the tundra where I settled, so that's nice. So I can get a lot more of three production tiles as well. So my capital is pretty production heavy, thankfully. Alright. What do we got? Man, who the fuck is taking the settler one? Because they really are on that shit. Like, as soon as possible. I'll do that. Because I was wanting to build it anyways. So that'll take some stress off that. Uh. Shit, now I don't know what I need to do. Farm? No. I'll put you there. I'll use you later. The capitals. Tundra tiles really can't be worked out like that. So I'm just gonna leave it. Oh boy. Just now see something. Don't worry about that. I'll I'll take care of it. <laughs> just look away. Look away, child. I thought clear. How much? A hundred, yep, that's what I figured. This is gonna be bad. This barbarian came in right there. Dude, I'm gonna take all these cities. Religious ones are gonna be the first to go because they're religious and they're not gonna have much military. Ooh, he might be ahead of me on that one. I wanna take him out really early game so he doesn't get his special units. Because those are a problem. I'm gonna move that, um, oh. Yeah, I'm down for money, dude. Are you kidding me? It's money. Fucking kidding me? Ugh. I have plans for this. Alright, so now where do I want to settle, though? I'm thinking over here somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. I'm thinking there. Hold on. I need to make you stay there so that I know that barbarians aren't going to take that settler. Uh, and you need to go back to protect to to protect the city, of course, because I'm I'm gonna build. Well, I'm gonna buy a, a warrior, yes, but still, it'd be nice to have another one around because I also have to take care of this barbarian encampment. I got my two scouts out, so it should be good. And this one's gonna continuously go, so should be safe. When I settle the city, I might just buy the warrior over here. Yeah, I will, in fact. Oh, fucking course. Move one. How many turns? One, two, three. I think three turns. God damn it. That'll be about right. Oh boy. You was not expecting this one, was you? Nice right, scouts going back over there. Ow, shit. Kicked my water bottle. At least it wasn't open, I guess. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you just move. And that turn, then next turn, I'll be able to settle. I'll keep the scout in the capital. Well, no, I can just buy a unit. That's right. Well, I'm going to buy a unit, but, you know. Takes time, people. Takes time. I remember that game I had that fucking, like, 
I had I was growing so much population that I literally had to create settlers even if I couldn't settle them. That's how bad it was. It was actually ridiculous. Alright. I don't know how I feel being on the coast. I might have to move inland just a bit because I don't trust being right up against the coast, especially with this, uh, that now fucking playing this game that you can have. Oh boy. What? What? Why did you move right back towards it? Yeah. And they say computers are going to be taking over the world. Yeah, my ass. Swear, buddy. Let's go with that one, huh? Wow. That kind of fucking hurt. Not gonna lie. My feelings and my physical being. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, we got some good tiles in this. This is an all tundra city, which isn't good necessarily, but it's also not the worst. So. What? Well. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Yeah, that should be good. Ten turns, though? Jesus Christ. It's a little much, isn't it? Oh, well. Fuck it. At least I got a food tile that's over here. Like, I don't have any farms that can be built over here, but at least I got two whales, which if I do, it should give, like, at least three food. But I think the crabs might be food. So, yeah, I'll be able to reach the seafood. So, all right. If I build a harbor, it should be good. I think if it's in my borders anyways, as long as they that use my builder, it should be fun. Okay. We need to build uh, two warriors. Just to make sure. Uh, I'll use the useless tile. Alright. Uh, should probably start building farms. Alright. Uh, you can just work production, I guess, now. Yeah. I always have at least one working production. That way it's fine. Yeah. Alright. So, the problem with going to war with city-states is the fact that if I take out too many, they're all just going to wage war on me. So, I'm going to have to take it a little easy. At least that's how it used to work. I don't know about right now, of course. How can you, but, you know. Alright, so when I need food, I'll have two farms here and uh, these tiles, so, yeah. Okay. Go on, Slinger, do you want to? I'm not walking those borders, are you? Okay, fair enough. Ooh, I'd say just sit there, buddy. Uh, yeah, just build another farm. That way I have something to fall back on. Okay. Alright, each one of my cities is secure. For the most part, anyways. I had two cities early on, which... Okay, he's apparently got three cities. And more culture than me. That's not okay. I don't like that. But okay. Under is my passion. Love me some snow, let me tell you. <laughs> Alright, let's make a mine there so we can at least make that an equal one. Alright. Just fuck the Treaty of Reside now. <laughs> Just to make sure that Slinger doesn't go around and try to attack my build or anything. Slingers are the bane of my existence. Same as, same as archers, really. Unless you're, like, super ahead no of them, then, you know, that's fine. There we go. Alright, what are we doing? Guess we should get riding, huh? You might have that. Yeah, I'll just make this one sit in. Same as this one. I'll just move them around. Yep, yeah, get over that. That boy. Slinger? 
Metal Slinger, at least not in that distance. Dude, that is a really good fucking tile. My money is just overflowing out of my fucking assholes. Yes, I have multiple assholes now. <laughs> oh boy, that ain't good. Without You're making a scout to fight me, really? You couldn't be more like, I don't know, cool about it? Alright, you're gonna s not settle. I almost said you're gonna settle there. You're gonna sit there. Let me figure out where not... Okay, fair enough. Uh, you're gonna go there, so yeah, we'll move you. You do that, because they're about to attack the shit out of you. Can't wait to get this new cat card. Hmm. Oh, it's coming in the mail, so get ready for that, by the way. I'll take one more hit, and then I'll actually, you know, take care of what's left. Because I don't want to get cocky. It could be that my downfall, of course. Alright, well, Vinta still got 19 attack strength, so... Oh, both of them died. Just threw themselves at me, huh? Fair enough. Alright, I got money, once again. I love me some money, let me tell you. Money is... Oh, so great. Alright, I'll just make you go now. Because I've gotten this. Danger on the Earth's have Kazan has been defeated. The barbarians are driven away. Okay, so that should be the, the end of the closest barbarians to me. So I think the first one I'm going to go with is Leventa, then Kabul, and then Jerusalem, and then Mexico City. And I'll have my entire band of cities surrounding my capital. That way I'm protected. Right, and then I'll move on uh, uh, Arabia. I should probably get sailing and not archery. Because I don't necessarily need archery right now. Yeah, I'll get sailing. Because that's what I need right now. I'm going to need that food. So let's do that. Probably going to need more production. So I'll make you build a hill and you'll just sit. You'll just sit there. Let me move you there. Almost to a golden age, but I don't know if I'm gonna make it because I'm almost out out of the uh, ancient era, so I don't think I'm gonna get it. But I'll get the normal era, which is good enough for me. I don't mind. This city's gonna have a hard time growing. Let me tell you, it is not gonna be good. All right, uh. Should probably get the spearman, and I'll get the card that's one less maintenance, and I'll be able to create a shitload of spearmen. And then when the time comes, I'll be able to upgrade it to pikemen, of course. All right. I might attack Mexico City and Levent at the same time, but I don't know if I'll have the resources to fund that. Especially taking on two city states and their units. So I don't know about all that. I'll need at least three spearmen for each city. Not to mention I might need one archer. So if I go... Well, I could probably go two spearmen and one archer for each city. But that'd be risky. Because I run the chance of... Uh, dude, I am surrounded by city states. Like, absolutely surrounded by city states. I put it on Pangea and put, like, the max amount of city states on. And, like... Are you fucking kidding me? I mean, it... Oh wait, yeah, the blizzard doesn't affect me because I'm Russia, that's right. Yeah, I'm fine. I have no reason to even be like, any sort of hectic or anything towards it. One more turn to the hanging gardens get done, I'll have that. And then once that's like that, fucking it won't take much food to grow, at least not as much. 25% less, in fact, because that's 15% less, and I already got the one that's 10% less. The ascent so, I only need three-fourths of the food I usually would. Let me do that, and then uh, we'll get a bunch of warriors here. 
seven turns. The sailing can wait because we're gonna militarize the Rhineland. No, <laughs> that's Germany's thing. That ain't that ain't Russia's thing. I mean, chill. Hmm. Is that like the only thing Vince is building? Okay. <laughs> so weird, but fair enough. Oh, Mexico City's already got fucking an archer. That sucks. That's gonna be a problem. But as long as it's only one, I should be good because they can't attack multiple. And Mexico City doesn't look like they have a lot of units. Probably because of the start they got. Half Tundra. This city, when I capture the city, it's gonna be like touching this well that city's borders like all the way god damn dude Cairo is really fucking close to me and I don't like it but if I capture this city I'll have the loyalty of this city backing up because that's why I built the monument and I'll build a monument in this city and then it should be enough to at least counter the loyalty that the capital is going to be giving off it was luxury but yeah uh, no, we're gonna wait. Let's city garrison now. I'll go with him first. Yeah, St. Petersburg. Because then I can start making settlers the second level that he gets uh, without using any population, which is super helpful for expanding really quickly. I'll probably fill out the entire bottom tundra, take all the city states, and then keep moving until I can't anymore. That way I have the kind of landmass to just fucking be able to take over really anything I want whenever. Don't tell me you're trading with me. That better be the city-state because I something good is not about to come your way, friend. Who knows? I might get the fucking ancient era golden age, dude. Because, like, I'm at 19 out of 22. I only need up to fucking 22 and I'm in a golden age. Granted, I don't exactly know how to get, you know, something such as points for an age I think it's like building districts and shit like that I'm pretty sure anyways oh I didn't realize there was die near my borders I know there's die oh I know that was a city I seen die okay never mind. I'm gonna start mobilizing millions now <laughs> ah yes Okay, Cree. Ooh, you're a lot closer than I thought you was. That isn't even your capital. That's just the city you started to settle towards me. I don't like that. And I'm going to show you how much I don't like that. <laughs> I have the biggest military so far. and I mean, half that's scouts, though. I don't have the best science, though. So we're going to have to, like, figure that out. I'm going to have to militarize, take over a couple city-states. Only a couple for now. And then, uh... After that, we'll, uh... Yeah, let me start moving these guys. I mean, you might as well build fucking... Well, no. You should probably be on warriors as well. The warriors will be the backup. Once I can start making uh, spearmen, then I'll start making that. But, like, for now, I'll use a couple warriors for each city as well. Just for, like, the backup. They're the disposable units. It'll be the pawn, so I can just throw them at the enemy, and the spearmen will go for the city. If I can help it, of course. Oh, I didn't hit the golden age. So fucking close, too. That was very close. Bronze. I shouldn't have got bronze working, but I really needed it to take over these cities. So I'll deal with it. Each new specialty district, gonna be getting a few of them, so look out for that, I guess. Uh, let me do this. No. <laughs> no. No. Uh, yeah, I didn't figure I could make anything for you. Um, we're going to create a hill so we have three production. So, yeah. <laughs> Uh, how much military strength? 120, he has 112, he has 91. Okay, so I have the biggest military, not the best science, 
also not the best culture. I'm paired though with culture to Arabia. I have the most money as well though. I didn't realize I was making so much either. I'll probably buy a uh, couple archers when I get archery. It is not the sailing good. We'll go for archery now, which will be one turn, and then we'll go for that, which will be one turn, and then uh that. Okay. Oh. Okay. That's fine. Mobilizing a shitload of people. Where you at? There you, are, you son of a bitch. Thank you. Production is the name of the game right now. If I can pump units out as fast as po possible, I'm going to. Without a doubt. Number of people living in my empire? Dude, it's only eight chill oh you only have oh no you got two cities fair enough oh Babylon what the fuck <laughs> hey Babylon didn't expect you to be here I shot an fair enough just gonna gonna situate my man you are right next to volcano and a river that must suck Sorry, friend. That was really fucking suck, dude. Uh, yeah, we'll hit that one. Yeah. And then the third one, oh, yeah, yeah, the third one I'll hit the die. And it'll give me, uh, money for it. And money don't lie. <laughs> Arabia is 200 coin, which I don't really like. I got the most faith, surprising as well. Well, not too surprisingly, because I'm literally mostly in the tundra. I'd say about 80% of my like civilization is in the tundra right now. And all my tundra tiles get faith, so... Not too surprising. There you go. There you go. I might be able to just take their city out with, uh... With those warriors... But of course, I'm still gonna move the uh, that spearman there. I just go over here. Yeah. Yeah, one there and two turns there. All right. I might be mobilizing too much. <laughs> I have 160, and that's abnormal for having two cities and nothing else. And they're in the tundra. Then again, I am Russia, so I'm getting benefits. A strong economy. Okay. You'll sit there. You'll sit there. Uh, you'll sit there. And you... Hmm. Yeah, sure. Might as well. So now, we'll go up here. And bam. So now that city will still grow. But at the same time, I will have my, uh... My whatchamacallit. Ooh, Mexico City has a decent amount of units. A lot more than what, what I would have accounted for, granted. Okay. Well, there we go. Alright, it's one turn game now. <laughs> Each turn I'm gonna have a new unit. I have 235 manpower. Arabia has 173. What? Arabia, what the fuck do you have that you have 270? Oh, that's a lot of production for that. Never mind. Oh, I think I might have got the one where the camps are um, plus one food and plus one production. Very nice, very nice. Okay. Alright. Cool. And we're gonna get that die. Cause I don't want to fucking die now. 
All right. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this is risky. I'm be taking two city states one at once. This front's very weak. This one's very strong. I should have probably split them up more. Either way, I think Arabia. Yeah, they got horsemen, so I have to get my signs up by taking over more cities and settling more cities. So. Out to you. Yeah, sure. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. Nigulu. <laughs> Nigulu. <laughs> I love that. Sometime. I love that more than I love a lot of other things, and that's very rare. Uh, let's settle there for the die, of course. Is hey die. Uh, and we'll settle here. Not here. Not settle. Okay, we're mostly in place. You go there. Uh, I think I'm gonna wage war when these, no, oh, when those two get in place here. I may not be Fred, with the red beard that can take over city states easily as nobody's fucking business, but I sure as hell will, you know, fucking industrialize past this shit. Do not get me fucked up. I may be behind, may be behind in science now, but you just fucking wait, dude. Can't stop what's coming. Already another one? That's interesting. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna sign this, dude. Uh, we're gonna put him at Kazan, because when I take, uh... Mexico City is going to need the extra loyalty, so by then, hopefully, I got the uh, level up for it. Got that iron. Wait, so does that mean I can... No. I can't upgrade them yet. I need to get two iron, that's right, don't I? Where's iron? Nowhere near me yet. Mexico City? No. Leventa? Oh, there's iron here. When that city grows, I'll settle another city down here, which will be risky because it's not going to have much going for it, but I'll settle next to the river to maximize its effectiveness. Or I could settle at half in, half out of the, uh, of the tundra, which would also work. Man, my military strength almost 300. Mm, that's hot. I'm gonna get that. Is everything alright here? 25 turns do you grow? Yada yada yada. We got pretty good production. Not a lot of futile, obviously, so we'll work with this. Alright, Mexico City's got a couple archers and a warrior, which is about what I've got. Except I got an archer and I got warriors. The warriors will do most of the work. I'm not too much worried about like the warriors doing stuff. It's more so I'm worried about the archer getting hurt because that's what I'm mostly going to be using to uh, attack other units in the city. Mostly the city. Because it's going to do some good early damage. Alright. Uh... Alright. Yeah. Ooh, maybe not. Oh yeah, because it only does 25 damage and the city is 20, so it's not going to do as much as I thought it would. That's very sad now. Yeah, sure, whatever. Just go there. Uh, you go there. We're definitely going to have enough to take that city. Uh, but I'm not so sure about this city. It's a bit risky for this one. I'm gonna have to have these two hitting like all the time, so I might have to end up buying another unit, but I should have enough money. Although I'm getting down now because of my maintenance. So when I get political philosophy, you know I'm gonna be on that ass. I'm gonna have to shoot my archer at that archer because they're gonna be attacking my warrior. 
and I can't allow that. Laventa, you had a lot more units than I thought you did. Alright, we're gonna have to call it off on that one. Okay. All right, you know what? Risk is risk is involved, but you know that's fine. Risk is always involved. Can't have anything with you no know, without a little bit of risk, you know. So it'll be fine. Hmm. <laughs> food. Yes, food. Yeah, it's not gonna be doing much against the city itself, but uh. The unit I will definitely use it towards. Yeah, so now I won't even regen health, so I can just hit away at it if I wanted to, but I'm going to regen that unit's health. I forgot there's two archers, actually, so one could shoot my archer, and the other could actually shoot... No, both of them could actually shoot my archer. And the warrior could have... Oh my fucking Jesus. That's bad. I, uh, underestimated Mexico City. Not so much the Levent. The Levent, I was pretty on the money, I'd say. I was pretty aware. I was pretty woke. No. <laughs> okay. Hopefully, I don't have to... Yeah, I should have shot the... Oh, fuck. That's okay. You'll just sit in the water. Uh, I got my other archer ready, so I should be good to at least repel the attack if it goes bad. So I'm gonna go ahead and move you there. You are gonna hit him. And you are gonna, bam, get that promotion, and bam, you're gonna heal. Meanwhile, you're gonna, ooh, not attack. <laughs> you're not gonna attack because that would have been technically over the river, I think. It qualifies. Oh. oh, he declared war on Jerusalem. Okay. Yeah, so everyone's trying to get closer to each other. Strategic. Very strategic. And a good strategy, but still. Yeah, okay. Take the city with the spearmen, so it's not that bad. Aw, oh, fucking loyalty already, dude. God damn, it's already a problem. There we go. See, if you already take out the city-state, then it won't have too many um, problems in terms of... Mm, do I raise it? I'll keep it. I'll keep it for now, because... uh, I don't have any pressure on it. That's the best I can do for it. I don't know how many turns it's going to be. And it's already at 50 loyalty out of 100. And it'll be falling at 8, so that'll give me about 6 turns. So yeah, I got enough turns. Granted, not really the best, but got a good amount. You will definitely stay there. No, no. You go back. We're staying on those tiles. Hmm. We're gonna do the uh, combat strength because I'm most likely gonna have to start. Yep. <laughs> That's good, so I'm gonna do that. Uh, yeah. 50 production towards settlers would actually also be good. So we'll drop down one production for the uh. Oh, hello. Yeah, I forgot. I didn't, I didn't really take you, did I? Didn't really take you. <laughs> Don't know what I was expecting. I was surprised by you for whatever reason. Don't know why I would be. Okay. We're gonna have enough, I think, enough manpower to take that city, but it's gonna be very close. So I'm not gonna have very much manpower after this, but I will have manpower. 
Uh, will I go to War Witch again 30 turns? Maybe not. So, yeah, I'll accept that. I need the three gold per turn. I got the maintenance card, so I'm still making the same amount of money as I normally would, but still. Alright, my science is going up, but I'm still going to have to make a campus in my capital, I'd say. Oh. You know what? That's the game plan I didn't expect you to have. So fair enough. You got me there, Chucko. That's right. You thought I was going to say Bucko. <laughs> Alright. Loyalty still a big problem, or is it just like... Okay, yeah, no, it's only 4.7 per turn now, so it's it's okay. I mean, plus 12 gold a turn, so, you know, there's that. I'll probably just be able to buy units at this point forward. At least a bit more manpower from that. When is this fucking volcan volcano going to go off? I need the resources around that mountain. Although I have a lot of resources around the mountain that's needing work. So I don't know if I'd be willing to do that. It'd be risky doing that. Very risky, in fact. Oh. Well, that's Leventa's. Uh, okay. Not what I expected, but not necessarily disappointed. Okay. This is the new world order, whether you like it or not, guys. Trust me, though, the Russian world order is the best. Honestly, you can't really get much of a better world order, guys. America, maybe, but that'd be risky. I don't know if you'd want to fucking be ruled by those guys. Let me tell you, you know? <laughs> me being an American, downsizing Americans, you gotta love it. Oh, they actually took Jerusalem. I don't like that. I'm gonna have to at least take Mexico City or Kabul to be able to compete well enough. Because he's got one, two, three, four, one, two, three. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to take at least one of those cities to be at least well leveled. You're still unloyal? Son of a bitch. Hmm. Oh yeah, we can change the tiles up now. Yeah, you guys are good. We don't need to go into overtime now. What's the what's what's it looking like? Negative four. That's it, really? What the fuck's your problem? Is it just pressure? I'm guessing it's just pressure. You guys can do what you will now, by the way. 72 turns will grow, huh? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Can I uh, raise the city from here? No? I'm going to have to take the city and then raise it again? That's fantastic. Alright, well you build something pointless like this then. Oh. I could make a pretty decent ally there. Okay. I'm getting ready for my forces just in case he decides to attack me because I'm getting worried about that. Alright. God damn it. <laughs> Going with a warrior then, boys. And an archer because a new archer is coming up. Should be able to replace what units I'm probably going to lose. It's a shame that I got the loyalty down so much, but it's still dropping, so there's not much I can really do about it. Is there anything I can do to rise the loyalty? Because that's like the only... Oh, yeah, governor. I guess you'd be right. See if that does much. Yeah. I'm gonna move you to Leventa. He'll take three turns. Hopefully you can stay alive in three turns. If not, well, I mean, maybe he was destined to die. I'm willing to accept that. Oh, How much manpower does Saladin have? 97. I could be able to put up a fight. 
Because he's using horsemen. And I can fight horsemen. Because I got spearmen. So I might go to war with Saladin. Solely for Jerusalem. <laughs> Jerusalem and Jerusalem only would be the reasoning. Wait. <gasps> the loyalty. It's not going down in Levent anymore. That is crazy, but okay. And I'm down, dude. Are you kidding me? Okay. Mexico City, please. Just submit. <laughs> I really don't feel like bothering with you right now. Alright, I need to make up my decision next three turns I'll base myself off of to uh, go to war with Saladin. Oh my god, dude. The pressure for this city is going to be immense. I'm going to have to settle this other fucking city over here. At least to add more loyalty behind this city. Because this is insane over here. Hey man, I'm not going to tag you. Chill. Betty thinks I'm probably coming for his uh, his food or his guns. He might be an American. Please tell me someone got that racist joke. Can't really be racist if it's uh, can't really stereotype someone if uh, you know I'm stereotyping myself. Okay, Saladin, you need to be like stopped, bro, for real. I'm gonna have to declare war with him. Well, one, I'm not with him. If it was with him, you know, it'd help him, but it's not. This is gonna be a bad fucking two front warrior. Wealth can okay. Okay. I'm thinking here. It won't get the benefits for housing, but it'll be able to get more of the good tiles. Decent tiles, they're not good. Almost not at all, in fact. <laughs> but you know. Alright, they're probably gonna end up building that, so let me do this. Alright, uh, hey, my man. Man, you really hate me right now for whatever reason. Oh, borders? Hell yeah. Uh, hey. Okay. How about you? Nah. Ugh. Council of Fires, is that what he just fucking said? Fair enough. Oh yes, as it should. As it should. Now, how about... God damn you. Alright, fuck it. Saladin, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Saladin. But you leave, you leave me no choice. You left me absolutely no choice because I can't have you making cities that close to me, man. I can't. Like, I'm sorry, but I literally can't allow that. Okay. And the bad thing about this is I'm probably gonna lose this. But hopefully not. <laughs> this dude's about to get fucked up so hard by two archers and a horseman. I moved him intentionally closer so I could uh root so I could avoid the second spearman there getting hurt. Oh, never mind. Okay, well, that doesn't make much sense, but okay. Oh, you want the only diplomacy I have? Ooh. <laughs> Tell you what. Take it. Man, they just really hate archers, don't they? 
I guess they realize that if you don't take out the archers, that's just gonna whittle down your city. Like, to the point where you can't really do anything. Okay. Sorry, Saladin, but you left me no choice, my friend. You left me no choice. I cannot abide by someone who pushes so close to my borders. Two units at a time should work, so I'll heal this unit and then next turn he'll have a little bit more health and I'll attack with him and then that turn I'll either kill the, off the city or it'll be two turns from now. And that's why I gave him promotion, because the city's doing like half the fucking goddamn shit. Hmm. Oh boy. Yep, you're done, though. Alright. There we go. That's perfect. City can't attack back, so I'll just keep attacking and then just healing. So you just sit there. The only way he can get that city to not die is if he fucking takes his archers there. And I doubt he will. Please? Oh, fuck yes. Thank you. Mexico City, you're fucking great, you know that? Hmm, that's probably gonna be useful. Okay. Alright, alright, that's good for now. Ooh, I was gonna capture Kabul and now that fucking the tables have turned and now I'm trying to help them. Because I can't I can't let Arabia get this other city. It's just I can't. Because if I do then I'm gonna be way too like up close to Arabia. It's just gonna be too close for me. And I won't be able to stand for it. If bread is we was gonna go to war anyways at some point, so might as well be now. Just heal. Yeah, you boys just heal. Just keep the city alright. <laughs> You just heal. Hmm. I'll do the... Because I have a funny feeling I'm going to get attacked next by those archers. And by a funny feeling, I mean the funniest of feelings. <laughs> just the most funny feeling you could possibly have about a funny feeling. Alright, Rush is getting thick. Rush is getting real thick. Not as thick as Arabia yet. Again, yet. Oh, dude, you made a horseman when I literally have spearmen surrounding your place. Terrible choice, terrible choice. So the way of, like, how, um... Basically, by the way, if you don't know, how, um... How the system works for how to make the cities stop like healing is you gotta surround them on um on the fucking uh basically you gotta make sure that no matter which tile they come out of you can attack them from that tile from like the tile next to it or something I guess Kabul's nice to me now this is for you, Kabul. Oh god, fuck. Jesus Christ. Oh, the city's still healing? That's weird. Okay. Didn't expect it, but that's fine. Well, it's not healing, I should say. Kabul's got their city, and you know what? That's fine. Oh, uh, yeah, they are healing now. God damn it. The Lord made. And then this one can move there. And you heal. 
Can you also heal? Ooh. <laughs> this is not good. I mean, it's great, but it's like absolutely horrendous, dude. This is not how I imagined this game would go. I think we'd be so damn packed together. And my scouts haven't even gotten anywhere, really. I mean, they've gotten places, but not much. Moscow begins first settlement on North America. What? What do you mean? That's the first set. Oh, do you mean like a new settlement? Like, basically created for the sole purpose of that? Fair enough. Ooh, fuck. God, I love, I love Russia. <laughs> Oh, really? They went inside the fucking city? God fucking damn it, dude. The archers are basically gonna be useless then. Fair enough. I'll move you there then, because I think you have to have the high ground. Ha 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 ha, Anakin joke. Okay. I'm technically with Obi Wan set up, but still. Okay. All right. I like how the first game I played on this, the first game that I played, like the first game I played was the first game of this I recorded. By the way, I like jumped in not knowing what the new features exactly were. So. But now on like my third or fourth game now, because I play like a game or two all, uh, the you know capture or whatever, recording. So um now like since I played like four games, I kind of understand it a lot more the loyalty system. But you can still get fucked over pretty hard from the loyalty. I gotta say, it doesn't exactly help when like you can get fucked over really hard by it. Unga boongas coming for your oongas. Ooh, I can make a swordsman. That's interesting. <laughs> I like having mostly a spearman anyways, though, so I think I'm going to keep it for now anyways, because I have no maintenance costs on them, because I have the card that lets me. Only five gold. Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> you have a stone hatchet. Get out of here, fucking Indians. <laughs> I'll take your land. <laughs> I'll become the new America. Test me, bitch. Test me. You made a horrible choice there. See, you think I'm gonna attack the horsemen? No, I'm just gonna attack the city now. And I hope you realize that. Even if it's at the cost of archers, I will do it. That's where you fail to understand my uh, my reasoning. And even then I can attack you. Which, bad idea right now, but you know what, I can still attack you. So, fuck you, bitch. Alright, monument and then that. Ooh! <laughs> a lot of city-states. It is a Pangea, but I didn't think we'd all be so close together. Feels like we're really close. We're all friends, right, guys? <laughs> strange collar for those Indians, by the way. Very strange, but I do like it. I like the collar palette they went with. It's interesting. If nothing else, it is interesting. All right, Sananya. No hour of life. San Sananya. I don't know how you feel about saying that, but you know. Why do I do this? Why every fucking time? It literally happens every time. Like, there, it's not even a joke. It's so fucking annoying that it happens so much. I just want to see what's over here. What do you got going on? Great general? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so even if the worst one attacks me, it should be good. God damn it. Is 
replay this. There we go. Put this back down. Okay. Oh, really? You're going for my city? That, that's your plan? Futile goals. What you fail to understand is I will still kill you with every fiber of my being. Curiosity of scholars, now our swordsman wields it as a weapon for the test. Uh, yeah, first first time in the world, huh? Wait, am I the first ones with swords? Seems very weird. I don't know if I can believe that. <laughs> Alright, what's even further? Farmland. Great. <laughs> Fantastic. Glad I did that. Nothing. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, everyone's super close together on this map. So far, I think I got the largest empire. Not necessarily city-wise. I mean, yeah, I also got, like, the most cities, I'm pretty sure, as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. But I still have a lot of land as well. Just because Russia takes up that much more land. Eight tiles per city they start with. And then they still grow after that, normally. So, yeah. Oh, boy. Yeah, you're dead. <laughs> What are you doing, swordsman? We're well, not swordsman. Yeah, whatever, dude. I don't care. Oh, you have only 50 si Well, actually, that was last turn. Let me see this turn. Hold on. When it loads in, it'll actually tell me. No, you still have just 56. Congratulations. <laughs> I'm just gonna heal on that ass. That a great profit? Wow. Okay, fair enough. Oh. Okay. You didn't discover much else more than me other than like over here a bit. And up that way. Man, you were trying to get as far away from me as possible, aren't you? Jesus Christ. Oh, you were trying to f Oh, dude. Last thing you should be trying to do is fight a two front war. Okay. All right. Again, almost the golden age, but it's probably gonna be a normal age. Although I don't know. I don't know. All right. You want half my iron, and for what? That? No, I don't think so. I have to. I have to say no on that one. Ugh. Man, you got a lot of horses, don't you? I really like your horses. I like that. <laughs> that's a lot of that's a lot of horses you got. I respect that. Because I'm gonna take those horses and make them into knights when I can. Oh, my science is now catching up. I'm still, you know, not leading at all by any means. In fact, I'm like the worst Wait, in waste. science. But the fact is, is I'm making progress, ain't I? I sure am. And you know what they say about progress? They don't say fucking anything. Not a thing, alright? Alright. <laughs> alright, and our first campus shall be in Kazan. Not gonna put it there, though. I will put it on the uh, Tundra Hill. Not Tundra, Snow Hill, because that was no Tundra at all. Uh, five population. We'll do a... How happy are you? On a scale of 1 to 10, how happy are you? Not too happy at all. Yeah, we're gonna have to do this. <laughs> you are, in fact, unhappy as hell. And we'll make walls on you. Alright. There we go. So now that city's gonna be giving off more loyalty right here. So it'll give off loyalty to more cities if I decide to go this way. But the cities, if I do go this way, will be the city states. I've never considered city states much of a help in this game anyways, unless they're like really good city states, which there are quite a few, but still, they're not as good as a lot of, like, 
There's only like five good ones. Like five real good ones. Alright, let me check something. No, okay, it wasn't important. Okay. Uh, worker... What do we got here? Pretty good spot. Yes. Uh... You are the one that needs the camp. Ooh. I have to do it to him. That's a lot of science right there. Oh, I have a whopper in this city. No wonder I got a great profit. Where's that? There it is. Didn't you realize? Why do you have a holy site? I mean, that's cool, but like... I didn't expect the city state to have a holy site, but okay. What's your pop? Okay. Good enough for my science. Hmm. I'll do that one. Yeah. I'm gonna start jumping ahead in science by a shitload. Yeah, fuck it. Uh, that's bad. Um, hello. How many archers do you have, my dude? A little annoying, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. How much military? 102? Alright, you're starting to militarize a lot, and I'm not liking it. Although, we have about the same science, so we should be pretty leveled off now. Attack my archer? Really? Of all things to use your horse to attack me with, those. Well, uh, to attack me? Mystery. Of all the things to attack with your horse, you attack the archer. That's what I'm trying to say. That's the one. <laughs> oh, I got another governor point. What the fuck? I mean, hell yeah, dude. You kidding me? All right, we got a horseman there. We'll move you up. You will heal. City's probably about to have walls. Pretty relatively soon, I'd say. Most likely, anyways. We're gonna do the forward, forward push. Ugh. Damn, dude, City is really going after the city states, ain't she? Well. Her name's not Sophie, her name's Thomas, or, you know, something with Tom. Or just Tom, I guess. Yeah, just call her Tom. Or she wouldn't mind, right? <laughs> probably not, come on. I'd say, yeah, she probably would. She would probably chop your fucking head off and try to feed it to you. Even though your head has the mouth, so she'd probably just try to stick it down your windpipe. Yeah, the archer does basically nothing anymore. That's cool. I'll do that. If I can take this city, I'll I'll sue for peace with him because I'll fall behind in science before long, and he'll be able to get the edge on me. Because I'm running out of units now, and I don't want to get overly cocky, like uh, you know, a certain silly man with a mustache did in World War II. This city isn't worth too much to them, anyways. Yeah, that they they were definitely willing to give that one up because, wow, okay, because uh, this one's the one with the horses and stuff, so that's really the only one that they need. I knew that it wouldn't be worth that much to them. <laughs> Definitely no. I'm willing to make the sacrifice. Yeah, you just heal. You just took a bit of damage there, buddy. Alright, you go exploring some more. Oh, look at you. 
ענוק דידו, המלקות הוא האום לכת חדש. Okay. This is the first time I've seen her in uh, a Civ game, not gonna lie. Oh uh, yeah, it's an honor. Don't want to see the great Fiat... Phoenician? I won't call it Phoenician. Or is it Phoenician? Phoenician? I'm gonna say Phoenician. The great Phoenician cities. Carry a word of it back to your land and to the rest of the world. You sound cocky as hell. But I'm sure you got good reason. Yosemite Valley to me is always a sunrise. Yosemite Valley, yeah, okay. Yeah, whatever. Religion. You know, I gotta go with the lion head, and we're gonna name it. We're gonna name it. Let's see. This is purely a joke. Purely not my actual standpoint. I should say that. I should clarify that to someone who thinks it's just like how I am. I want that amenity and I want... Yeah, we'll have to do that because I'm starting off my religion very late. Fuck Arabia is the true path of salvation. Please ignore all those other ones. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, that's about what it's going to be like, too. That's pretty much how it's going to be. Jerusalem starts with uh, any other cities? No, just uh, Levant and Jerusalem. I'm okay with that. At least I got two cities starting out with it then. And I'll be able to probably convert uh, the city. Oh, damn, you're you're spawning spearmen now, huh? Spawning spearmen now. Getting desperate, are we? Huh? That's fine. I might take the your capital since you're getting so desperate. Universe are fire, water. We can no more... You're gonna show such weaknesses to your enemy. Ever. Oh wait, let's go for monarchy, and then we can do all that. Yeah, okay. Uh, kind of feeling money, but yeah, yeah, I'll do that one. Let's hit it up with the archer first. <laughs> At least I still got one archer. I'm happy about those. Very happy. You just wasted a, uh... Yeah. <laughs> I was gonna say, you just wasted a spearman. Oh, fuck. I forgot which child... What? Okay, hold on. One main problem I have with Civ 6, okay, with this new shit, is you can't back out of the raise or keep city screen anymore. You have to do one or the other. And I can't remember how bad the tiles are or not. I know it's got hills, but I don't know how bad the loyalty is. I should have checked it. Oh, well. Oh. Never mind. We're good. Make that monument. Dude, what is up with the production, bro? Why are we not working any production? We're actually working production. That's terrible. <laughs> okay, fair enough. We've grown 52 turns. Good now, good now. I'll have to bring a uh, builder over here and uh, build a shitload of farms in this city. Like I have to do usually when I'm next to the tundra. Not on the tundra, next to the tundra. Because you literally... What I don't get is why did they be like, oh yeah, dude, you got extra faith and production for all your tiles as Russia, man, but no, 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 there's no farms. There's no farms here. No, you can't have any. I think it's to prevent you from just staying in the tundra the entire game, because obviously if you're just going to be a turtle and stay like in your area, you're just going to stay on the tundra. No one wants the tundra, so it's not like anyone's going to fight you over it, you know? Mm, I think I can take one more city. Left. I think I'll take your capital. That's what I think I'll take. Ah oh, yes, now I am superior in science every in every way. 
Except for all the other people, you know. Forget about that. Just focus on me. Not them. Quads and lingering outside classrooms and campus. Yeah. There we go. That's the one. Uh, you boys just heal. You get right there. And you heal. Yeah. I know that's a pretty good spot, but there isn't much tundra. It's mostly snow. Although, I could settle there if I really wanted to, but I'd attack the city-states before enemies. I'd at least want, you know, a way to ensure that that city would also be fine over there. I'm about to hit a golden age. I most likely will. Considering I'm not even like halfway through this age, the uh, classical era yet. I, mean, I might go for peace. I might take his other city though. That way it's at least split up his trade routes between his capital and his other cities. Ooh, pyramids. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> No one else is gonna, but I sure as shit will. Alright. Oh, I could have got the money from that. That's saddening. I mean, you might as well kill him, right? Uh. Google? You, uh, you right there? Kinda, you kinda scare me a bit there, buddy. Just gonna, just gonna do that. You're fine. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna do that. Oh. Got that money, that gold, that faith, the, the hoe. You know, all of it. My religion's gonna start spreading pretty powerfully. Because it's plus 25%, uh, you know, whatever. The unhappiness just went down for this city. And then it's probably also gonna get from back to over here. Because it'll be spreading the unhappy- well, the happiness, not the unhappiness. Yeah, he's dead, as I figured. Not surprising. Why are you coming over here with that chariot? You stay the fuck over there, buddy. Buddy old pal, little boo. Now listen here, asshole. Ooh, that's a problem. Yeah, that's a pretty big problem. <laughs> uh, we got a problem. Alright, I'm just gonna close this tab. Because it's probably just slowing it down anyways. There we go. Alright. We're good. Great library. Obviously gonna do that. The fuck? <laughs> it's the great library, dude. Are you kidding me? That's gonna take away my food tile, but it's fucking worth it, dude. Are you kidding me? How many more times can I say I'm like, are you kidding me? I could probably do it one, more, one or two more times, right? Probably be pretty good. Oh yeah, I forgot if I lose units, it drops loyalty down. Yeah, loyalty's about to go fucking AWOL here in a second then. That city is not going to be doing good. Oh, do I sue for peace? Oh, I really don't want to sue for peace though. That's a, that's a bitch thing to do. Mm, mm. God damn. <gasps> what happened? <laughs> Alright, you get a campus. Uh, three science. There's also three science back here, but volcano. Four science here, but also volcano. But I think that might be worth it. Well, no, we'll just put it on three science one. It'll be a good trade off. Yeah, whatever. All right, listen, listen. I'll be willing to make peace with you. Left. Hmm. If you don't understand my reasoning quite yet, don't worry. You probably won't. At least not yet. I'm gonna have to take that big city right there. 
in order for the loyalty to not drop that fast. And then I'm gonna have to take that city back. So most likely I'm gonna be doing some roundabout bullshit to take the loyalty down. I'm basically gonna have to like take out the biggest city that's in affecting it. And then I'm gonna have to take out, uh, then I'm gonna have to take out the smaller city again because it's just gonna drop and there's really nothing I can do about that. So yeah. Oh uh, yes, the apprentice ship. Hold on, let me. Provide initial 10%, extra love, and provide science as well. Hmm, that'd be nice if I had any. That's probably the one I want. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, hey, Victor. <laughs> Hmm. Can I make the city happy? You know? That could work. There you go, buddy. There you go. Yeah, be happier. You got this. You're fine. You'll live through it. How about you? You good? Yeah. We're all fine. <laughs> Ain't no big deal. Oh, shit. Safety knows where the ink is. That's turn events. Didn't know they'd have any kind of correlation. Okay, so this is bad because now I'm using uh, my swordsman to fight the horseman, which is terrible. Oh, we're with Congress. Oh, no. <laughs> People probably have problems with me. Freaking towards buildings in this district. 10% uh, combat. All the players making them prefer this outcome. Ooh, thanks for telling me. Uh... I'm thinking. Commercial hub. So I'm gonna vote two on that, and I'll vote two on that. Fuck Arabia. <laughs> uh, shit. What's your. Is it Judaism? I think it is, right? Yeah. Okay. We all good guys? Are you guys gonna ban fuck Arabia? That's fine if you choose to, but you know. Catalyst, okay, that's fine. City center, god damn it. Alright, well fair enough. Can't really hate on that. Alright, well I need to buy units. Can't buy any units. <laughs> cool. Guess I'll have to wait a couple turns. Hmm. Make some swordsmen. Whoa, what? Barbarian camera down there? Like right there, I bet. I have no time to fuck with your petty grievances, so be gone. Or face my wrath. Alright, well, we're gonna place that there. Because that seems like a good idea. Not gonna lie. No, actually, we're gonna do that one. Thank you. <laughs> because we need that production. Okay, what's about to happen? What's about to go down? This is about to be bad. Oh yes, your delegation is most welcome. Most extremely welcome. Me and the other dude still friends, that's cool, I guess. That's interesting. Okay, well that's uncool of you, my dude. Really, like, come on. Oh my fucking Oh. Nah, fam. I don't think so. Oh wait, did I see thirty on the upvote? Oh my god. Great, so I'm gonna have every player ever fucking trying to fight me. Oh! Oh, it's four versus one. I think Arabia tried to do that. But he was right. Yeah, I put three into it, and then my dude put one into it. Saladin was the only one that put one into the good one. 
Without... Ooh, I knew I was holding onto it for some reason. Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, well, we're doing this. Uh, this one. There we go. Yeah, that's the health. Alright. I don't know what your goal was. Oh, I see. Mmm, that's a real good deal. Hmm. Yes, I accept. Alright, boys, you're a part of my religion. Welcome back. Oh, I need to get missionaries. That's bad. Oh, are you trading with me? Okay. Didn't realize that. Apparently you're trading like twice with me because there's two trade routes going this way. Nice. Unless you just like sent it to one city and sent it from that city to, you know, you put a dam in a lake. Good job. Ooh. Oh, well, technically it's a river. Ooh. Yeah, I don't think that counts as a lake because the entire tile would be, um, would be water. It's just kind of weird looking. It's like land with water. So no, I don't think so. I think the turn may be fucked. I think we might have to call it. Because sometimes the game crashes like this. You know what? Good way of finding out. Options, right? Confirm. Ah, see, I did call it. Alright, well... <laughs> God fucking damn it. Ugh. Well. That's something. Um. Son of a bitch. Okay, well. Uh, fucking Fantastica, right? Uh, how long have I been recording? Yeah, that's about fair, I guess. So this will probably be out with a, an uh, Assassin's Creed video. I don't know if there will be anything tomorrow. Most likely, I don't know. Probably, I might I might record something else today as well, but I'll just save it for tomorrow. Uh, two days from now, I'll have a new capture card, so stuff should look better by then. So look out for that. Uh. And yeah, if you like this, I've done a shitload more videos in the past, so yeah. And I'll probably keep playing this game until, like, they come out with number seven. So yeah, I guess if you want to keep watching it, then uh, look forward to that. All my videos are unedited. Basically, you get the experience that I get. Uh, I'll probably learn how to edit at some point, but for right now, I actually kind of like it this way because everyone gets the exact same experience as me. Uh, and if I need to pause the recording, I can just pause it. So if I need to, like, you know, if something goes down, I can, like, unpause it and be like, alright, this is happening, yada, yada, yada. Let me catch you up on this. But I don't usually do that. So, yeah. I usually just uh, let you guys get the same experience as me. But, uh, yeah, if you dislike the video, just dislike the video. Just let me know what I did wrong. Uh, constructive criticism. Tell me what you'd like to see more or less of and uh yeah i might do that unless it's something stupid then obviously i won't but if it's actually something that i agree with then i'll do it but if it's something like me talking less or more fuck you that's my right i'll do what i want uh but if it's something like maybe more editing i'll try to learn editing and uh see if i can do something with that uh or if it's something with i don't know like faster pace games I'll try to like put it on online speed which is the fastest so we can get through it faster so yeah 
Which I already have it on quick, which is um 35% faster. But yeah, online is 50% faster, so it's pretty quick. But yeah, just uh, let me know what you think and uh, check out the other videos if you want. And with that, I think I'm